www.ryanmcdonald.com. As you know, I am a trainer for many professional sports athletes, last three years with the New York Mets, and still from current celebrity clients. One of the big things that people want to do is they want to get ripped and lean in a short period of time. And they've probably heard that before. Everybody wants to look in a short period of time. But my guys especially, they want to look good. I like to call this my red carpet, get ready, get ripped for the red carpet workout. So basically what I want to do is take you through a circuit. It's going to revolve around what I feel is the best exercise, cardio exercise to get you ripped and lean real fast. And that's just using a simple jump rope. All right, so we're going to start off right here. Let's get into a two foot hop. And I'll demonstrate it once and then um, I'll just, I'll just tell you when we're going to do it from there on in. If I can ever get my jump rope uh, unwound here. So basically what I'm going to do is uh, start with just a two foot hot version of the jump rope. So right here, I'll choke up a little bit because I don't have much headroom. I'm going to come up here. Just a simple two, two foot hot. And you see, and I want to do this for 60 seconds. All right, nice and smooth, nice and loose. I'm going to fall to my feet. Keep it going, keep it going. Keep it going, hop a little bit, side to side, keep it going, 60 seconds. That's going to be the cornerstone now. It goes right here into my, what I call my dive bottom push-ups. Dive bottom push-ups are going to work our shoulders, chest, and triceps all in one move by simply changing the position of our body. So we start off up high, we're going to pretend that there's a fence right here, i got to sneak under and sneak back. So I come down here, sneak through, come up, on this side of the fence, now i got to get back down and under, down, push up. I work my shoulders there. So down here, chest, up here, triceps at the lockout, down, sneak back under. Okay, I'm going to go to failure on those. As many as I can do, come right over here, under my bar, I'm going to do my inverted row, lay back, pull up, whatever you want to call it. Legs out straight, arms about shoulder width apart. Okay, locked in, pull up, down, pull up. Try to bring your chest to the bar. Get as many as I can. Use your arms, use your back, pull up. Get it to failure. Head right over back to the jump rope. For the jump rope there, I'm going to be doing 90 seconds. First time 60, second time 90. After my 90 seconds of jump rope, I come over and grab a pair of dumbbells. I'm going to do a reverse lunge curl. Okay, so I'm going to step back, up, curl. Step back, up, curl. About 12, 14 of these, 6 to 7 on each side. Okay, take them down. Okay, the weight you're choosing here, choose a weight that will make you fail on your 12th or 14th rep. And come up over here again, work the other side. Biceps, let's work the back side. Push down, what we call it, a, tri a tricep wood chopper push down. So we start off a little bit elevated, a little bit up, come down, and when you get down here, elbows are tight, and then you lock out. Okay? Up here, cross your body, lock out. We go 10, flip around the other side. Okay. Back to, back to the jump rope. No reps, guys. You keep going. 120 seconds, two minutes full of jump rope. Same way, two feet, hop, and back. Now we're going to go back to the legs. Step up. So from here, again, checking my headroom. I'm going to slide this down. Okay, way to step up, two here, now watch my head, come up, drive it up, and down. Okay, 15 on each side, hold one dumbbell, I like that unpredictability and the balance requirement of one dumbbell. From there, as I jump out of your picture for a second, grab the fishing ball and work the back side. Quad dominant, hip dominant there. Hamstring, glute 
glutes, regular high bridge. Here, I don't like to keep my hands on the ground, too much stability. I want to make a little bit more work for my core, so I hold here, high bridge, and down. I'm pushing straight through the soles of my feet. Okay, high bridge, 15. We're almost done. Back down to the push up to the jump rope again. This time we're working our way back down. We went 60, 90, 120. Now we're back down to 90 again. 90 seconds of the jump rope, two foot hop. Then come back down here, grab a kettlebell, medicine ball, whatever you want to do. Whatever is, you, know, you prefer. But you're going to do a V up, V up twist. So grab here, come up, twist, twist, down, up. Twist, twist, and down. Up. Twist, twist, down. Up. Twist, twist, down. Twist, twist, down. And from there, go straight into a rolling Pilates roll up. Down. Roll back. Roll back. Again, fighting on the way down, keeping your chin tucked into your chest. So right through, I pop up from there, I get my last 60 seconds of jump rope bow, and that completes my whole circuit. Now, you want to go through this, and for the real deal, take that whole circuit three, three times in your workout. Thus, another great workout to get rid for the red carpet workout a lot of top celebrities are using now to get looking really good in a short period of time. You can catch that and a lot more over at athletelean.com. This is Jeff Cavalier signing out.